Good morning and welcome to your daily operations weather briefing. Well, we've got plenty of cloudiness out there. Even had a few stray showers earlier this morning, but all that's pushed off to the northeast. And we're going to be dealing with uh, mostly cloudy conditions throughout most of the uh, morning hours and then catch a little break in those clouds as we go into the afternoon and see a little bit more sunshine. This is the uh, current surface analysis that we have. You can see uh, still in the warm sector we saw very warm conditions over the weekend and we're going to continue to see warm conditions as we go through the day today uh, warm front north of the area and uh, off to the west we've got a weakening cold front that will be pushing across the area later today into the evening hours but for us uh, most of that energy is going to be very weak so uh, even though we do have a few showers that, sh that are showing up on radar this morning as you can see off to the west a lot of that activity is going to be weakening as it comes through the region, so uh, just dealing with some cloudiness associated with this disturbance. And then we'll see a little bit of clearing later on this afternoon, as I said, um, as we go into the afternoon and early evening hours before uh, potentially seeing a slight chance of a thunderstorm again later this evening as the uh, frontal boundary moves through the region. So looking at our current conditions out there, again, plenty of cloudiness, a few clouds at 8,000 feet, and we see those broken deck right around 15,000 feet, an overcast deck at 25,000 feet with unrestricted visibilities. Winds out of the southwest at seven knots and temperature right around 79 degrees. So uh, really not all that hot out there this morning, but as those clouds begin to break up this afternoon, we'll see the, wind, the uh, temperatures uh, begin to rise into the uh, mid to upper 80s for daytime highs today. Humidity level at 79%. Looking at the next 24 hours, and what we can expect, again, mostly cloudy conditions through around the noontime hour. We'll see those temperatures warming up as well as we get to around the uh, 12 p.m. hour today. As we go into the afternoon, maxing out with our high temperature right around 89 degrees. And then seeing those partly cloudy skies continuing into this evening. Now as we go into the uh, evening hours tonight between 8 and midnight, we're going to carry a slight chance of a uh, light rain shower or a thunderstorm, but only about a 10% chance of that occurring uh, between the hours of uh, 8 o'clock and midnight tonight. So uh, keep an eye out for potential pop-up showers or thunderstorms during that time. But again, looks like the uh, upper level energy will be pretty weak as it moves through the area. So uh, only very widely isolated thunderstorms expected during that time frame. So we go after midnight tonight, partly cloudy. Uh, conditions continuing through the overnight hours. And as we get into Tuesday, uh, we'll see those southwesterly winds that have been bringing in the uh, very unseasonably warm conditions for us. Uh, we'll be out of the northwest tomorrow, so much more comfortable conditions, looking at uh, temperatures in the mid-70s for overnight lows tonight, and uh, seeing temperatures on Tuesday only maxing out at 86 degrees under partly cloudy skies, and also uh, carrying less humid conditions as well on Tuesday with those northwesterly to northerly winds. So we go into Tuesday night, we'll continue to see partly cloudy skies with a low temperature of 70. And then for Wednesday, expecting mostly cloudy and cooler conditions, we'll actually see our winds turning out of an easterly direction on Wednesday. So I uh, could see some lower level moisture bringing some low cloudiness during the day on Wednesday. And uh, can't rule out a, a stray light rain shower or two uh, during the uh, day on Wednesday as well. Not looking like a very high probability right now. So keeping that uh, probability in the 0 to 15% likely uh, green category for Wednesday as of right now. But uh, definitely looking for some cooler conditions as we'll see the wind off the water on Wednesday and a daytime high only of around 82 degrees. Well, that'll wrap it up for this morning's Daily Ops briefing. We'll be back at 10 a.m. for your full weather briefing. Have a nice morning.